let's figure out what 11 and 12 sixteenths minus 5 and 8 sixteenths is. And then we might have to simplify it down to lowest terms. So the way I like to do these is to kind of separate out the whole number part of the mixed numbers from the fractional part. So I can rewrite this number right over here as 11 plus 12 over 16. And from that, I am going to subtract, and I'll put parentheses here because I'm going to break this part open. I am going to subtract. I am going to subtract 5 plus 8 over 16. 5 and 8 sixteenths, same thing as 5 plus 8 sixteenths. But I have to remember, I'm subtracting it. I'm subtracting this whole thing. So I can rewrite it as, I'll rewrite this part, 11 plus 12 over 16. And if I'm and I'm subtracting 5 plus 8 16, so I can distribute the negative sign. So it's going to be minus 5 minus 5, negative 1 times 5, and then negative 1 times positive 8 16. So it's going to be minus minus 8 over 16. Minus 8 over 16. And then I like to do the whole number part separately and then the fractional part separately. So let's do the whole number parts. We have 11 minus 5. I'll write it here. 11 minus 5. We'll do that part. That's the whole number part. And then we have plus, plus 12 sixteenths. Let me do this in pink, maybe. Plus 12 sixteenths. 12 sixteenths minus 8 sixteenths. Minus 8 over 16. And 11 minus 5 is 6. And I have 6 plus. And then our denominators are the same here, so we're going to get something over 16. And 12 minus 8 is 4. So this is the same thing as 6 plus 4 over 16, which is the same thing as, writing it as a mixed number, 6 and 4 sixteenths. 6 and 4 sixteenths. And this is the right quantity, but we can simplify it. 4 over 16 can be simplified. Both the numerator and the denominator are divisible by 4. They both have the factor 4. So let's divide both the numerator and the denominator by 4. Divided by 4, divided by 4. Since we're dividing by the same thing, we're not changing its quantity. And so this is equal to, we still have the whole number part, 6. But the fraction part is now 1, 1 over 4. So we get 6 and 1 fourth.